गुड मॉर्निंग लिसनर्स ऑन रेडियो आकाशवाणी 106.5 एफएम एंड दोज हु आर लिसनिंग टू आवर लाइव स्ट्रीमिंग एट आकाशवाणी रेडियो डॉट को डॉट टी वंस अगेन दिस इज ताउशो बुद्धा विथ योर पॉपुलर प्रोग्राम नो योर फूड्स अ प्रोग्राम टू एजुकेट यू अबाउट वेरियस इंग्रेडिएंट्स होल व्हीट फ्लावर बासमती राइस rock salt coconut oil shri gun blend of spices and all that you need to know for a balanced and healthy living we are coming to you with the compliments of taosho buddha foods suppliers of swarna and deep stone grind whole wheat flour deep basmati rice surabhi and lakshmi coconut oil shri gun blend of spices biryani pulao masala and many more also we are coming to you with the compliments of deep foods khao to jaano the frozen deep foods all these are naturally good hygienic fragrant tasty and invigorating seeking your health with every product remember all the products that are manufactured they have an instruction how to use it they have a manual to maintain it but god did not make or give any instructions or manual for man so it is an open end it is up to you what you want to do with your body with your mind and remember when body and mind are in harmony there is a inner harmony that becomes door to the beyond first the harmony has to be at the level of the body then between body and the mind then this harmony between body and mind becomes the door to the beyond just to recap what you need to do use whole wheat stone grind flour as your staple food the basmati rice which is naturally light and easy to digest himalayan rock salt because it has 84 natural ingredients and common table salt when you consume it consumes nearly 23 times of the fluid from your cells so it becomes a prop and also its ions are isolated himalayan rock salt is nearly 250 million years old preserves the natural ingredients the 84 of them it is rich in sun energy and you remember if sun does not rise you will not rise from the bed sun is very important to bring everything in life the birds begin to chirp to give the first message of the rising of the sun the flowers started blossoming the whole life comes into aliveness so sun energy it is rich in sun energy then coconut oil which is naturally good it is like your when your drainage system gets blocked the food that food items and the other garbage that is allowed to go through the drainage it blocks then you need to clean it otherwise it starts overflowing in case when we consume trans fats all the vegetable and the seed oils be it canola be it sunflower be it safola be it soya bean be it any other oil that you see on the shelf they are all trans fats and your margarine and other brand of products these are trans fats firstly on the high temperature the ions break down they become the trans fat which blocks the heart arteries and creates problems for you you remember when your car engine is not taken care of and you are taking the shortcuts not changing the oil filter or gas filter with each service or you are not flushing the engine 
so that do no slush remains there then you have to carry the car engine to be bored and to be refurbished but there is no such things when it comes to man car engine can be refurbished two three four times but the human heart cannot be refurbished more than once and that too is not a five thousand or three thousand dollars as it happens in case of the car the human heart to be refurbished it costs a lot of money you have to decide what you want to do and then the trouble that comes along with it and dr marcola says you should avoid all these trans fats like a plague use coconut oil in any form coconut right from the raw fruit you can take the coconut water the gel the coconut milk i use coconut milk in almost anything that i make the gravies the dals i use coconut milk so another form firstly it is coconut oil then coconut milk so naturally it increases its nutritional value this you can do also and also i had put lakshmi coconut oil bottle in my fridge it gets hardened and every morning i dig i stick off coconut oil and take it as first thing in the morning as my breakfast there is a misconception somebody yesterday told me that i don't use too much oil just a half teaspoon so does it mean that when rain falls you do not have to spray the oil underneath the car then what happens the car squeaks your body squeaks your brain cells need good quality fat a misconception that oil is bad has been propagated for too long and when you stop the consumption of the oil then what happens do you get better and when all these things are happening the alzheimer's disease the heart problems blood pressures are not changing so you need approximately 15 ml of oil per day for your brain cells to be active and working in harmony lubrication i may take the stick of coconut oil maybe one or two times instead of taking nibbling a cookie here a cookie there i will take a stick of coconut oil and nibble it now i will pause for a while there are people who are gluten intolerant suffer from celiac disease they should go for the gluten free flours like buckwheat sorghum which is jowar millet the ragi which is the red millet moong dal flour the rajgiri flour the singoda flower which is in english known as water chestnut flower and rajgiri flower all these flowers are available at naipaul's extra food and prem singh's puja bhavan you can use these flowers mix it along with your whole wheat flour and change its configuration so that it becomes less gluten because gluten is part of everything whether you are taking medicine vitamins lip balms all these things have gluten and what happens with the gluten now when you are gluten intolerant or suffering from celiac disease which is basically malabsorption meaning nutrients are not absorbed properly and an abnormal immune reaction to gluten celiac disease is also known by different names it is genetic meaning it runs in the families sometimes it is triggered or becomes active for the first time after surgery pregnancy childbirth viral infection or several emotional stresses so what happens actually in this how does it work there is a particular part which is the inner lining of the small intestine called villi these are finger like protrusions lining the small intestine and villi normally it's villi v i l l i 
Willy normally allows nutrients from foods to be absorbed through the walls of small intestine into bloodstream. Without healthy willy, a person becomes malnutritious, malnourished, no matter how much food one eats. So such people should increase the gluten-free contents. And as I mentioned, the names of the gluten-free items, cassava flour, corn flour, is also added to the category of gluten-free foods. Now I am switching over to something which I spoke to you a couple weeks ago, deep frozen items. For the first time in Trinidad and Tobago, on the shelves of the supermarket will is available deep foods. Khao to jano. These are frozen items. Cocktail samosa, which comes 50 in a pack, and now this is like you have to fry the deep fry and now when you have parties the terrace party the wedding party or any occasion or your drinks party you can have these foods the, the cocktail samosa on a platter with toothpicks and people can use the toothpick to pick up one samosa which is known as finger foods and while the party is going on and you have your drinks, if that be your lifestyle, then you can use that. Then we have the regular potato and the pea samosa, which comes in packing of 24 and 36. The price is extremely good and it is authentic East Indian flavor, not too spicy. Also, we have a flavor of spinach and paneer. Paneer is cottage cheese. Concentratedly rich in protein. And spinach is good in two things. Number one, it is rich in iron. So, and iron helps in maintaining the red blood capsules in the bloodstream. So, this also comes in the packing of 24 and 36 as value pack. Then we have chicken samosas, which comes only in a pack of 24. In addition to that, we have naans. Naan is actually made with the wheat flour, but it is luckily or unluckily, the chefs have not used the whole wheat flour. So we have to go with whatever is available occasionally when we want to have something different. But instead of baking powder, it has yeast and milk is added to it to make it nutritious. These are cooked in clay oven. Clay oven that is known as tandoor. The roti is hand rolled and put it inside the walls of tandoor which is red hot and when it is ready it falls on the ground or before it falls it is picked up with a skewer so this comes plain naan and garlic naan so all you need to do heat it up on your tawa or in english griddle or in the oven because i do not recommend the microwave because it is the heat waves that cook your food and that is not healthy to be uh, used occasionally when you have no choice then you can do it but otherwise avoid using the microwaves instead use conventional oven or the griddle tawa and when you finish put the regular butter not the hydrogenated fats like margarine and other products i am not mentioning this is margarine is the easiest way to say but the whole range of those artificially hydrogenated oils use real butter or ghee and serve it also we have paneer paratha which is the paratha filled with paneer and aloo paratha these products are available on the shelves and one thing which is for those people who are gluten intolerant i have a fermented 
item you have to rush because the stock have finished in two days time and Prem Singh is the only one who has the stock I am told this is called dosa it is a South Indian recipe it is made with the rice flour and washed urad dal in a certain proportion it is soaked and grind to form a barter then barter is allowed to ferment so no flour is used in that and in filling it has the potato filling the spicy south indian potato filling and it comes it is served with dal which is the tur dal or our yellow dal mixed with vegetables it is tani which have a tamarind flavor it has the vegetables like pumpkin eggplant string beans bodhi tomatoes peas in it and also it is bitter so it has all the flavors the taste in it and a coconut chutney that is the particular item dosa it is bite size four comes in four pieces comes in a pack along with the frozen coconut chutney so you need to heat it in the oven conventional oven or on the tawa and use it as a breakfast or diet or main course meal as gluten free and soon you will get another item which is also made with the same barter of rice and urad dal it is in the shape of puffed like something like what you call pao it is known as idli it is also served with sambar the dal and the coconut chutney gluten free very tasty for breakfast when for the first time my children went to india and they stayed for 3 months when they came they were eating they were actually staying in south india and they were eating dosa and idlis as their breakfast and lunches so when they came back they did not like the trinidad food they found the food have no taste and they want the sambar and idli actually initially i brought this dosa shipment for my personal use but it ended up happening that i had the big mouth and i mentioned it to everyone and everyone wants a pack to taste and in that everything finished but rest assured the shipment will be coming again and also we are bringing something that is called kulfi which is indian ice cream the whole process of making is different the ice cream is made differently kulfi is made traditionally in a different way first the mixture is prepared with nuts and and the fragrances then it is put in the metal cones and sealed with the flour so it is now sealed the liquid is inside then we take a, a metal or the the clay vessel a clay pot with the mouth open on top and inside it has the ice and also something so that the ice temperature does not melt quickly and outside it has the insulation of jute bag and all the cones are put inside and then this urn the vessel the pot is shaken vigorously and with that coldness it settles so it becomes very soft like the moment you put in your mouth it melts and also it is served with ararot noodles type shape so that i am not sure if that is coming with that but there is a particular type of this the malai kulfi and faluda so that comes with that we will have the mango flavor the tutti frutti kesar and kesar pista flavor all these will be coming in the next time but for now you have the cocktail samosas bite size something like your wonton size finger foods if you have anything to do with your parties and you need a little planning can give me a call at 683 8587 these products are currently available at prem singh's puja bhavan 
and soon will be available at few other locations because the shipment came only a day before. So for other inquiries you can give me a call at 683-8587 if you need these products for your personal consumption as well as you want to have these products on the shelves of your supermarkets a great food because whenever I went Florida or anywhere I brought deep foods naans and these things with me but it was very difficult to bring it because it's supposed to come frozen and be kept frozen so initially I neither had the opportunity to bring the frozen items to be shipped and secondly to be stored. Now I have the two facilities of bringing the frozen items and also storing in our warehouse which have the freezer section. So it remains totally in our freezer section. So when the items are ordered it comes frozen to you you have to keep it in your freezer section and when you are ready to consume you have to take it out from the freezer section and then you have to samosas have to be fried I, kulfi is ready to eat naan has to be heated but don't do the reverse process you heat the ice cream and eat the kulfi and uh, eat the paratha cold no paratha has to be heated back again and kulfi to be consumed cold. This is about the new products that we have now brought in. Of course we are coming to you with the compliments of our swarna and deep whole wheat flour stone grind that comes in three packings the 4 pound, 10 pound and 20 pounds. Then basmati rice, Himalayan rock salt with cayenne pepper and also Himalayan rock salt with black pepper Shrigun blend of spices naturally good hygienic tasty fragrant and life invigorating these are blended according to the principles of Ayurveda that is very essential how to blend the spices so your food have all the flavors the sweet the sour the bitter, the fragrant spices because if you find that when somebody has to go to a party or occasion, do you go without makeup and without putting on your perfume? So perfume is the aroma. Same way if the food is cooked, it is not looking good, how can you be attracted to it? And this is the reason in all the restaurants they use a different shades of red to create a little uh, ambience and this opens up your appetite. So the restaurants have that kind of ambience. When you go in the Chinese restaurant, typical Chinese restaurant, whether in Taiwan, China or Hong Kong, you will find the deco inside is the red and green color and gold color is used. So when East Indian food gravies are cooked, it's supposed to have a reddish color like a dark orange color and also it has the streaks of fresh cream that gives you the white. So it's a midnight beauty and it, when you go immediately you're getting the fragrance. When quite some time ago, a few years ago, somebody came from South India to our home and for those people we had been cooking the South Indian recipes as soon as the person walked in he said he is getting the fragrance of South Indian food and this is why it is important that you blend everything in your food of course we are coming to you with the compliments of Swarna and the Surabi coconut oil and also with the compliments of Prem Singh Puja Bhavan 663-2494, 663-6084, Naipaul Extra Food, Grand Bazaar, Arima and Shagwanas, Vishnu and those who are in South area in Penal Market, 
3785 Sukhraj Bhagwan Deen in Debe area 647-7275-377-0583 I repeat 377-0583 Price Club 671-7777 And for wholesale inquiries or for anything else you can give me a call at 683-8587. Thank you for being such a patient audience. This is Tausha Buddha signing off for this morning.